India is known for its culture, where the confluence of traditions with our daily lives brings vibrance, making it an integral part of our identity. Tulsi is considered holy in Indian culture. Its worth is not only contingent on its medicinal benefits, but extends to the aura of purity and wellness traditionally associated with Tulsi. This extensive significance gives rise to consistent demand for the production of Tulsi meat products. Jet, a humble village in Uttar Pradesh, is the heart of India's Tulsi Mala bead production. Jet derives its uniqueness and identity from Tulsi. Over 90% of the world's Tulsi Mala production takes place in Jet. The traditional method of Tulsi bead production is tedious and inefficient. It adversely affects the health of the artisans, causing problems like back pain and postural deformities, thus decreasing the overall health and life expectancy. Moreover, through multiple field visits, we realize that despite the hard labor, the artisans of Tulsi Mala don't get the value they deserve. Our interaction and observations reveal that the main reason for this discordance in the livelihood earned versus the efforts invested was the heavy involvement of our parties. These middlemen stockpiled raw malas and sent them to Vrindavan for further finishing and sales and returned a marginal sum to the artisans for their produce. This is where we, at Enactus IIT Delhi, felt an acute need to strive hard to uplift the lives of Jayat artisans and started Project Tulsi. For improvising the method of bead production, we collaborated with Rutag IIT Delhi. Rutag designed the Tulsi Mala bead making machine, which is an ergonomic and electricity driven machine with optimum RPM adjustment. That replaces the traditional method of bead making. It not only increases productivity by almost twofold, but also eliminates physical toil, enabling artisans to work comfortably and providing the flexibility to make more than 21 types of beads. We then aim to make this machine accessible to every house of Jet. We started reaching out to more families to understand their challenges. To achieve our objectives, we understood the need for setting up local entrepreneurs who can become grounded pillars of the project and also act as POCs for us. This way, we went a step closer to our vision of a self-reliant Jet. Through our field immersion, we came in contact with Dharmendra Ji, a local resident of Jet, who became our first POC and entrepreneur. He has not only helped us to connect more efficiently with the community, but also played a vital role as a retailer of machines in Jet. Through our training, Dharmendra is now well versed to repair any minor disruptions in the machine. We aim to establish more such entrepreneurs in Jet to achieve our project goals. In order to increase the acceptability of the machines in the village and gather feedback, training workshops were organized. These workshops gave over 400 artisans hands-on experience in dealing with electric machines. The current sales of the machines occur through our local entrepreneur via one-time payment option. Since the artisans of Jets find it difficult to pay in a single installment, we plan to set up three different deferred payment models. Rental model. Through the rental model, a person can rent the machine by paying a nominal monthly rent of Rs. 1000. EMI This model allows the machine to be purchased by paying in 2-4 to four small installments as per the buyer's convenience. Satyadari Under this model, a small group of villagers come together to collectively finance and purchase the machine. Multiple players in the Tulsi Mala value chain offer little value. In the near future, we aim to set up finishing centers in Jayat, shrinking the value chain and bridging the gap between buyers and artisans. The Jayat community will be connected to worldwide Tulsi Mala buyers through online gateways and e-commerce platforms. From our novel technological intervention, we are achieving 4 UNSCGs, impacting over 800 individuals in Jayat by selling more than 100 machines, thus increasing their net income by 100%. Their average life expectancy has improved and health problems related to back pain, fatigue, etc. have been successfully resolved. By June 2023, we project to sell over 285 machines train 570 people and create 5 new entrepreneurs directly impacting over 1200 lives. We even plan to extend our project to several other centers of Tulsi Mala production like Bharatpur and Lucknow. We are in conversation with the World Bank for potential collaboration with our project to increase the reach of our machine. We also plan to avail government subsidies and CSR to reduce the financial burden on the Jat community. With a team of 10 individuals and technical support from Rutag, we are determined to transform the lives of Tulsi Mala artisans. This project started with the resolve to bring the curators of our traditional art to the mainstream. And with our efforts, we are coming closer to a more inclusive world. We aspire. We believe. We achieve. We are Enactus IIT Delhi.